start by unpacking the pump and remove the screw holding the strainer. Remove the strainer carefully. Mark the different leads, earth, green, yellow, black, brown and blue. It is important to mark these so you can put them back in exactly the same position. Remove the pump housing from the suction interconnector. Pull the pump housing and the impeller assembly off the motor shaft. Separate the four leads. Place the pump in a vise and slacken the screws. Slacken the screw from the earth lead and remove it together with the earth lead and the washers. It is important to remove the three rubber seals. Before fitting the new cable, clean the holes properly. Unpack the new cable. The cable comes with a set of connector parts, which we will use later on. It is very important to run the leads through the strainer now. These three screws, which we removed earlier, we are now going to reuse. We do not, however, reuse the washers. We are also going to reuse the screw holding the earth lead in place. Now we can install the cable. It does not matter which color you pick first. Put a new white ring on the lead followed by the black rubber seal. Make sure the end of the lead is upright after placing the rubber seal. Now we can start with the cable installation. Put the lead into the hole and clamp it in place with the screw. Do the same for the second and third lead. Fit the suction interconnector onto the shaft in the marked position and secure it to the motor with two socket screws. Now we can fit the earth lead. First we position the screw followed by the new white ring and two new washers. Bend the stripped end of the earth lead. We are going to reuse this screw, but first remove the rings inside the screw. Put in a new washer and tighten. Place and tighten the earth lead. Check all screws and tighten more if necessary. Position the impeller assembly on pump housing and tighten the pump housing. Position the cable along the pump housing in the recess and push the strainer over the pump housing against the motor.
Fit and tighten the lost screw. 